We just finished with the second contest at HGS Auditorium with Tema Methodist Senior High School, leading with some 54 points. Well, I have the students here to share with me um, how do you feel about this. Let me, you are a contestant, and how do you feel knowing that you've made your school proceed to the next stage? I mean, the whole team proceed to the next stage. Yeah, the feeling is good. The feeling is very good. We hope for more qualification to the next stage. Yeah. Last year you were not seeded. What about this year? What what are some of your anticipations? What are your expectations for this year's contest? Mm, we are preparing very hard to be a seeded school. And we are hoping for God to help us. And we know he will help us. Okay. All right. Now what about you? He has said everything. So we, we, still, we, still, we still want to hear from you. How did you see the contest? Oh. And how do you feel? The contest was, was cool. So we are still preparing for the one eight and then we hope to be seated so by God, God is on our side so everything will be okay. Okay, all right. You know you, you are not a contestant. You came to support your, your students, your fellow colleagues here. And how does it feel knowing that your school has proceeded to the next stage? Oh it is uh, interesting to win this contest because uh, we have put in a, a excessive effort to be here. And we thank God for that and we hope we will get to the final. My God bless. Okay, all right, sure. So we're hoping to see you in the subsequent stages. But then I have um, your coordinators here from um, Tema Methodist Senior High School. Right now, how do you feel? Oh, I feel great. And we want to give thanks to God for granting us such a decisive victory. Yeah. And we pray that as we move along, we are going to do even much better than we have seen today. So that's what we, you should expect from us too. Okay. Right, sure. So that is um, Tema Methodist Senior High yes. School. And I want to say this. The Cedar schools should watch out. They shouldn't be intimidated at all by the score line. They should come forward. Thank you. All right. Well, yeah, great. All right. Just as you heard from him, don't be intimidated by the score line. But then I have um, students from Borga Senior High School. They were also part um, of the competition, but unfortunately they couldn't make it to the next round. Um, I, I, should, I don't know if I should be asking you how are you feeling, but then regardless, we want to know how you're feeling and um, what is the way forward now? Okay, actually, um, losing the competition, um, we, are, we are not that happy, but we are looking forward to improve um, our speed and then our accuracy and how we can also win the contest one day. Mm -hmm. All right, now you are a coordinator with the team, and what should we expect from Bulga Tanga Senior High School next year? Okay, so what I will say is that uh, you should expect the best. Uh, they have done their part, and it's a, it's a stepping stone. So once we have experience and we have identified our mistakes, we, we need to go and correct it. So we are correcting it and we'll come back strongly. Okay, now... Um, what about you next year? What should we expect from Bogotanga Senior High School? So, next year, expect nothing but the best from us. That's what I have to say. Nothing but the best. Yeah. Yes. Sure. So that is Bogotanga Senior High School. And that was the second contest for today at the SGS Auditorium um, with Tema Senior High School, um, Bogotanga and Shama Senior High School with um, Tema Methodist Senior High School leading with 54 points in this contest. Reporting for Joy News, I'm Jacqueline Ansma Yaboa.